we got a big box. I came home from work today and there was this giant like eight foot long, I'm six foot four and this box is taller than I am. Like it's, it's big, I'd show you, but it doesn't fit in the frame of the camera. It's massive. Uh, it's the Elgato Green Screen XL, uh, something I wanted to jump on. I have been using the Elgato Green Screen right here for a while, which is fantastic. I love how lightweight and simple it is to set up. It's backwards, excuse my computer camera is here. Um, the only complaint I've ever had with this is it's a little too small. Uh, as someone who is a broad-shouldered gentleman, by the time you get this up, my arms stick out on either end, and I can't, like, fully... You know, if, I, if I'm being animated on stream, my arms and shoulders get cut off and stuff like that. So I, I always wanted a, something a little larger. I know I'm not the only one to do that because, heck, I've seen people, like, buy two of these and set them up side by side. The XL is, I think, 25% bigger, uh, which is awesome. And I'm gonna unbox it and kind of see what it's all about. The thing that baffles me is this thing is, like, two pounds lighter than the small one. So they made it out of some sort of different material. I don't know. You can head on their website to figure out all the other specs. Uh, the other thing that I didn't love about this one is that it, it folds up into a carrying case. Like it's got a handle here and two clips that you can use to lock it shut. And the one time I used it for that purpose, it broke. The clip on the right just snapped right off. Like I was just carrying it. I didn't tamper with it. It wasn't, it just broke. So I'm hoping that the other one is made of some slightly stronger material. But judging by the fact that it's two pounds lighter, not really helpful. But we'll see what happens. Get it open. Oh, one more. How on earth do you do this? Oh, that's easy. So opening it up. No, oh, freaking. Opening it up, it's actually like really small. Like it's not like this. This is like a the the regular one is kind of bulky. This thing is like, it's really streamlined and, and tiny. And get it out of the box. So it sits like this, it looks like. We've got all this foam on it that we're gonna take off and get rid of. Just to keep it in the box flush. It doesn't bang around, which is nice. I'm shocked at how small this is. Like, it's wide, which is what we want, but it's like, it's so small. Oh, excuse me. So this piece has to come up to support the back. I'm not reading the directions, because that's just how I do things. So you twist the legs so that it's got support, and then Lift this up. Oh, okay. So this hook helps stabilize it. And pull it up somehow. There we go. And it hooks onto this. And then we raise this up. Look at that. And that takes up so much more room. That's crazy. And that took like how long to set up? Like I've only been recording for heckin' five minutes and we went from in the box to ready to go. That's nuts. Well, I'm gonna mess around with this on stream in a couple of days and that should be fun. So the Elgato Green Screen XL, I'll let you know how it is.